Oh, does she react to me killing the boss? No, she doesn't. See what the... See what a living, breathing world. Fantastic. See, just like Cold Vein, backstabbing is... Backstepping is, is fastest. Or, or maybe it is, maybe it's the same, never mind. You know, this will be all solved if I just climb that. I mean, I'm saying it doesn't look like that at all. Listen, my, my Egyptian feet have been burnt to the dust. Did I have you? Which boss was this? TVs of the Hundred Gates. Don't tell me. You made it by Ishtar. This confirms my theory. All these years of research must be the person, the Red Pharaoh's former lieutenant. You have to. Your cling on this proves it. No more mortal could have been capable of such a feat. Yeah, no kidding. We daughter of Ishtar have been looking for you for centuries, and here you stand. And this nightmare now. Found Oma Hamosis. Whatever is left of this poor soul, then I'll get rid of the sea people. They've been useful distraction, but once we get rid of the Red Pharaoh, I have no use for them. What, you hadn't guessed? You don't think it was merely a timely invasion? Well, we need some chaos to make our move free you and all that. Yes, the two lands have paid a hefty price for this chance to get rid of him. Don't waste it. Now go, make it worth all these sacrifices. Don't fail us. Ambush. <laughs> Fuck. I don't know why this game is called Fire and Linkage. Okay, take it easy. How many guys at the same time? You motherfucker on a stick. Lamellar queer. Oh, that's what it looks like. <laughs> oh, fantastic. Glad to see the developers on the same quality as Skyrim. <laughs> the armors. The armors have jiggle physics. Um, what did I just get? Rhinorsa shield. Small shield, great shield. I have a great shield. Inspired by the fiercely armored piece of the instant south, the shield is popular novelty in Egypt. What do you mean novelty? It's a novelty? Yeah, sure. Not that it matters. Oh, fantastic. Croft is back. So, where's the damn lever again? Father said somewhere near here, but I can't. I, ca I can't even. Yeah, I know you're from the Val Kings, right? But the has been raided by dry anyway in the wars. So I've ditched that loser Mentamos. Mentmos. Mimosa to come over to capital. Now I'm looking for another treasure, the relic of Avaris. Legend has it the Red Pharaoh keeps them in the place and opens the entrance. You can the three sick levers hidden all throughout TVs. Each one fires up a torch, and the gate opens up with three of them lit. Can you believe that? I mean, it's not a souls like, but what if they need to open the door in a hurry or something? Okay, developers, don't make fun of your own game. <laughs> hey, we know we did something. What are you dodging? Sh Wherever there is one man, there is multiple men. Are you gonna help me? Boob McGee? Don't dodge my attacks. Okay, stop pretending I'm your problem. I was literally about to say ambush. Did you just parry me? Does Don't shoot your arrows at me! Ancient Egyptians, didn't they have the Geneva Convention? <laughs> oh, I don't have any heals. Oh, oh, this is all skill now, huh? Why are there so many men in Egypt? Oh, Yabu Sharmuta. Why is everybody dodging? Um, hi. 
Oh, Mira is back. Look who made through the hundred gates. Don't you remember me? I remember all of you. I just don't know how you fucking got here. Bises, I remember the morning I saw you emerge from the dungeon all covered in blood. Okay, calm down. Well, I seem to have made you fortune soldier. Good for you. Me, I'm happily remarried thanks to a royal vicular, no less. Boring, but he lets me be and we share dip the, in his interest in politics. The Red Pharaoh? Ah, you want to enter the temple. Put down! Yeah, Habibi! Yeah, Vusharmuta! Yeah, Wen! Atla will shield! Yeah, Shar. Fuck your grain! Oh no. Never mind, the grain is fine. Ambush! It's it's so predictable at this point when the ambush is coming. You. Oh. Yeah, excuse me. Thanks. Hi. Why are women so violent in Egypt? Oh, right, because. the right jesus sir oh wait no in egypt that greens not not right sir sir perfect timing to attack Oh, there's a chest. Circuit grieves. Circuits? Who's circuit? Circuits worship to compensate? I, I like to imagine there's an Egyptian out there who loves this game. And they're going to be very mad at me. They're going to be like, Shall I not pronouncing any of the names correctly? It's literally impossible. What are you? And my answer to them is going to be like, Well, you know, what can I say? I'm a savage. Okay, take it easy, I'm not an... Hey guys, how do we make our game longer? Oh, I know, we make the player constantly have to... <laughs> of course! <laughs> Motherfucker on a stick from ISIS! Haram! Haram! Did you just wait two years to parry me? Yep, this is gameplay, all right. <laughs> Women, not even once, honestly. <laughs> Fuck your grain in particular. Um, how did that miss me? Yeah, camera, there's someone clearly there. Can I see them maybe by the end of the year? All of that for 400 gold. What's over here? This bear be the most amazing. Is this progress? Don't tell me that's for the fire. I have no idea what I was supposed to see there. The two French Canadians that made this game, they were just in a hurry to get back to their mom's womb or something. Since when do Egyptians not use a knife? See, if more cameras were like this, maybe I'd understand something, but this is a rarity. <laughs> don't tell me don't tell me this was my last victim here no there is more ambushes what's with the big mummy guardians why do men like to avoid what the fuck was that take it easy on the war crimes 
Leave me alone, soldier, or kill me by thought. Who cares? If I could see father again, he brought us to the quarry, the poor bastard, the things I saw down there, strangers, stone men walking, towered by. But have you been there? Bah, you're just laughing at me. So I'll just sit here, drink like water, and pie us out. Hey, the irony. Ambush! Oh my god, honestly, fuck you at this point! Ah! Can you... Can the column also get in my way? Why does everything... I, I like how the... Are the shields just useless? Like, like, just a simple hit takes me for some of my stamina. Please don't protect. Please don't block. Please die, tanks. Don't him this... What the... What's he... What is fucking Street Fighter Man doing here? There's too many Street Fighter Man around here. Yep, that's exactly what I was looking. Thanks. Thanks, Amanda. Oh, fuck your triple-ass combo. <laughs> yeah, of course I miss. I miss. Yeah, yeah, of course. Of course I miss. Uh, sector armor. Is that from the same set? Uh, it looks terrible, but whatever. You finally arrived, Satya. Oh, relax, I'm reporting you. Who do you think that the potential priestess get out of prison exactly? And you're eating my spies and aliens would have seen invasion coming. Let's say I have disagreements with my master and I'll welcome a regime change. So we can have a deal, but in case you fail, I need a safe way out. Bring me a full soldier kit. Curious legs and helmets and don't be a disappointment now. Don't already have it. Yeah? Yeah? Yep, seems like I have the set for you. Bring me a full soldier kit, cuirass, leggings, and helmets, and don't be a disappointment now. Your mom was a disappointment for having had you. Then what, you gave up on the war? Talk crew, told me to expect you, my lady. I should be glad to see the Red Pharaoh fall. Straight ahead is the entrance to the temple. Do what you must. I hope you remember my loyalty when you take the two crowns to all your life and prosperity and wealth. Oh no, it was... Can you, like, die by the end of today? Is that your wife, like, backing you up socially and mentally? That hit me? Bravo, bravo, bravo. I hope this game wins an Emmy and an Oscar. So what's over here? Another area with another shortcut. Also, isn't there a checkpoint anywhere? Can I poke her ass? No. You come, a completed creature, I see. Blooded, scarred experience. You have fought a long fight. Anyone can see that. What the rest can't see is the lies in your mind. Am I wrong? A choice, a terrible decision looms beyond that of destroying your powerful foe. An empty troll in a land broken. Is that perchance what you want to achieve? You don't think so. Egypt needs peace and peace needs a new ruler. But who will be that? The daughter of Ishtar, a woman driven equally by magic and fanatism? Or perhaps you, a soldier with the blood of the Red Pharaoh, still fresh in your hands. What should it be then? A different theocracy or a new tyranny? Oh, how long I see that. Farewell, decider of fates. I'm sorry. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Why is everybody in a corn on the rooftops? I told the little haired Bahamut that she'd stay in the city, but she would she would listen? Of course not. Well, if the barbians didn't get to her, then the cultists will, if you will. Can't say I'm very sorry, but you better not have taken my lapis earrings that little. Ah, gallant warrior. With them damsels in distress, find my earrings if you can. I'll ask word them to a temple on the side of Tibis. Hope Bahamut didn't take them. Oh, oh, loser? Loser? I thought we women gotta stick together in the Middle East. What happened? You know, some people, honestly... What are you taunting? You're trying to protect your wife. Shut the fuck up. 
Watch out with the grains, sir. You might starve your people to death. Just like the quality control of this game has been starved. The, what is that? Yeah, I totally know where that is. Thanks. More much appreciated. Uh, thank you so much for that information. Play as low as I just got my way. Look at that to reach up that asshole. He learned well from his dad's dick. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, come on! Fuck you, man! Honestly, at this point, it's more like, uh... I'm sorry, are you buffing up? Um, maybe we want to fight in the middle of the arena. How about that? So you don't like casually just one shot me on a good fry. It's Sabbath, bitch. It's Sabbath. Respect it. It's a Sunday or a Friday. All oh, right, Friday. A Friday and Saturday. Even she's struggling. Aten craft shabti. More like cap to sharmuta. I like how even the game wants to one-shot me with the buffs. All this skill. Oh, look at me. I'm so skillful playing this game for children, made with children. What do you drop? Okay, so just to be clear, the armor sets are not available for me. Fantastic. Why does that guy have skinny legs? I mean, not that the smurf women in this game are nothing to look at. Uh, but why do men, like, have the opposite proportions of a smurf? They have, like, skinny legs? What happened here? By the gods, I've seen you before! Yes, at the dungeon, set mud! Hey, you don't remember old Kitty, huh? Er okay, this is not racist, but honestly, every single NPC in this game looks the same. <laughs> Apart from, like, change their beard or eye, and that's it. Why, you made out to their right, I see. With all this verbal diarrhea me, I thought about running away but ended up coming here to enroll again. All I know is fighting an old to run and I'm too old to run around learning another trade. Isn't that the opposite? Ever too old you can't fight? But look at you, quite a fighter you've become. Those muscles! You surpassed me, youngster. <laughs> I have no more Jay's tricks to teach you. I know you'll do well by yourself. Go do that. Good seeing you again, friend. Oh, you're not gonna teach me how to fight now. I can't upgrade my weapons or anything. Oh fantastic. I was about to say, fantastic, the only thing is missing is an ambush, and guess what I just got? Abu Shalmuta, Shweya Shweya, Habibi. Oh, Abu Riyad, Shuhada. Yacheyi. Oh my god, Yacheyi. I like how a tiny dagger does that bunch of much damage. Fuck you. Why did I buff right in front of you? Get a poke. Get poked, bitch. I mean... I mean, seriously now... Please don't use the lunging attack. That lunging attack is ridiculous. Are you dodging half an hour later when I try to hit you and even then I will... Please, sir? Take it easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep on pointing fingers. You know what happens to people point their fingers? They lose them. Yeah, I have the guard stuff, no? Oh, look, another depressed motherfucker, but it's depressed in this universe. All those advertisements about timeshare in Egypt where you share like a, like a condo in the middle of the ocean with like 12 people. You know, what happened to all those lies? Heh, you don't recognize an old friend, do we? Just as well, last time I saw you in the set mat, you're all green behind the ears. Why, because mold? You never thought you'd make it this far, no sir. Me, bah, got drunk into a fight, my sweetheart, she left, I went whoring. You went whoring? With what? What muscles do you have to whore? What do we care? We all had the dead in a matter of days. Yeah, I am penniless, all for nothing. Text got smaller, might as well have died in the desert with a Jay. Hey, the one blame army job, help me pay for a jug or two? Yes? You drive a hard bargain, you jackal. Even though it's 8,000 gold, literally, here you are. At Lithium Curious. Um, light armor. Okay. Did anything change? Ugh, I miss the sweet rolls. Those sweet rolls Mira made in set. What do you mean sweet rolls? Do you mean your wife's sweet rolls or something else? Am I playing Skyrim? Oh, I got you. I got your wheel. No. Ha! 
How the fuck did it hit me? Holy shit. Was that a shortcut? Yep, just connect the entire sand over there because you can't push. I'm sorry, are you the prisoner that prisoned imprisoned? I <laughs> haven't seen you before somewhere. Doesn't matter, I guess I wish I had more life what you give in exchange for freedom. But no luck, lost my spine when the Majid conquered Shadat and had to evacuate the oasis. Apparently someone slayed Queen Cersei. Can you believe that? But then I tried to catch ship to Messenia, but the rest got me at Tavares. Well, I used to laugh at how easy to Jay got captured. Gee, I'm no better than her. Okay, I didn't expect an ambush here, honestly. I'm gonna... Yeah, just hit me, drink all my iframes. Okay, what's this conga line of pincers? What the fuck, guys? Drink like the wind, bitch! Oh no, not enough. Not enough stamina damage, nothing! Okay, what the fuck? I'm up the wall here. Miss Cool's a Scorpionino. Is there another scorpion behind me? There better not be anything behind me, honestly. Um, I'm sorry. What? What the fuck exactly happened here on this blessed Majain day? Um, I'm almost dead. What? Are you kidding me? This is where my checkpoint is? Go down, you stupid broad! Holy shit! Well, I'm always out of stamina or I don't have anything else to do. I, and I don't mean that in a social way. Oh, that's it? Yeah, Scorpius only dropped. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, the AI is having a very hard time understanding even what they want out of life. Am I seriously that under level that, like, I'm just getting levels by, by constantly dying at one ambush? Helmet of the Champion of Tebas? Okay, what weapons did I get? Into my attack speed, um... Breeze! Breeze Blade! Why is it called Breeze Blade? Surprisingly light and sharp. The blade's obviously mystical in nature, shining in inner power. Worshipper of Serget! You, by Serget, you killed him! You blasphemer! A curse on your offspring made the invaders slay your entire family. I'm sorry, are you trying to imply I'm wearing scorpion armor? Fuck you, how about that? They're trying to kill me first? C can I kill you to get your helmet? Are you pregnant, sir? Yo, stranger, I'm Putash too. My raw point my pr provisioner of beer and wine to the palace. I normally not stoop to lesser deals with men, but we're supposed to increase morale by providing grants like you with fine merchandise. Drink pearls to the pigs, if you ask me, but do not ask me. I have better things to do. Quick, what do you want? Rings. The cap is This token of promise you made centuries ago. It protects you. Nothing brings peace to a soul like an old keep. Malkite as green as flourishing oasis. Tireless traveler. Rumored to cover from any wound with only one single sip of life water. It's more precious than rubies. Okay, so more drops. So what is this? Yes. I mean, I'll find out later. Light weapons. Okay, so what does Tireless Traveler do? Shouldn't be on the walls defending. No, what about you, Mira? What about Mira? Okay, let's say 855 stamina. Um, could it be the attack speed? Melkad is green as flourishing oasis, bringing new vigor and stamina to your tired limbs. Maybe it's a stamina region? Maybe it is stamina region, actually. Okay, yeah, I think it's stamina region, although I'm not sure why... 
Was it not working previously or what was going on? Okay, I think it is stamina regen. Um, yeah. Uh, technically it's better. Yay, my first Sears upgrade. Yay, finally. Um, by the way, don't I have sets to give you? Okay, I have literally no idea what that woman wants from me. I have once no idea. Oh, fantastic start. Let me guess, an ambush or something to do with the casket. Can't I call it? This is a lot of enemies at once, honestly. Excellent, if I make it, I shall be Tucker, your lowest spy mistress. Why, if you don't, I'm just Tucker, another deserter on the way to Libya. <laughs> well, I can show you some of the technique my, I teach my agents. Okay. Uh, first of all, heavy armor, thanks. Support backpack, I think I maxed them out. By the way, I like how the developers apparently at one point realized the entire shield mechanic is screwed. So, this is the next best thing they could do with it. By the way, I like the size of the houses, you know, cartoons or not cartoons. I think people forget the part where in cartoons, you know, your ca your cartoon characters are supposed to live in houses. Yeah, okay, I can confirm oh, the ring does the stamina thing. Honestly, I'm not sure. I'm, 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 I'm not sure about a lot of the rings. They don't seem to work. At least this one works. I like to imagine this entire game has the same problem as uh, that other game, Salt and Sanctuary. Where like half of the rings don't work in the game or they just increase stats so they do nothing. Um, did I go down here? Yeah, I did. Well, I'm going now. Honestly, it feels like this should be the default stamina regen. This honestly feels like it should be the default stamina region, not gonna lie though. I, I hate how they don't explain anything about the rings, just no buy them and hope for the best. Okay, you're gonna be extra health. You're gonna fully heal me if I drink. Um, sure, get this. I don't need more life, although I can check how much life this gives, like the best ring in the game. Okay. So this is a stamina ring, I definitely want this. So what would this be? I've literally no idea what this is. Let me look at the stats. Health? Oh, it's only 50 more defense? The best ring in the game gives you the equivalent of like one one heavy armor part defense. Um, does, does that even matter? Okay, add 200 HP. What's the point of 200 HP if I get deleted every time? It's less than 200 HP, I think. No, I think it's exactly 200 HP. Sorry, it's even less, slightly less. It might be a percentage. Yeah, it seems like all the rings suck. Shield? Okay, shields don't have a penalty or anything like that. Alright, I can use you for fashion, I guess. I like how this is the one game where daggers... Shut the fuck up, please, with these ambushes, honestly. Just get me to the final boss fight or whatever. Also, I don't know why this armor piece was... Huh? Where's this? I mean, I don't think this could be an ambush. Are you? See, what a whimsical game. See, what a... What a whimsical game as you have to use the envir the environment to your advantage. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think I just realized what's going on. I think this is an area for the player to farm. Astratis Sword. Heavy weapon, Astratis. I don't know if this is good, but I, I love how, you know, it's As Astaritis or whatever, you know, Antara Doom. I... In my defense, there's so many dead bodies. How the fuck was I supposed to know where the trap is at this point? At that moment, and all the dead bodies are covering the trap. Okay, wait, let me, let me go back here and test this out. 
my philosophy in life. Let me test it out. I think that area is to farm enemies. To level up. Right? Oh my god, I think it is. Wait, am I... How much XP... Oh my god, look at the amount of XP I get just for an easy kill here. <laughs> look at this corner. <laughs> Yamada! Head. <laughs> oh my god the developers actually put in a place so that near the end of the game if you're under leveled you can can i get those clothes uh, you can you can like mass mass farm the gates are open finally the time pharaoh has strategies is coming make sure guide your armed hand deliver us from the red pharaoh let the reign of the daughters of ishtar begin to start day all life prosperity and wealth bless be astarte for teaching me how to farm Hello. Okay, so picking up that item is not... Oh, right, because I'm too close. Hey, what about you if you come over here? No, she's gonna refuse me, huh? <laughs> See, what a funny game made by dicks. So what the circuit uh, the circuit set is like the be is, is the Havel armor of this universe? Is the Havel armor of Egypt? I'm sorry, how do those sometimes hit me and other times they don't? Ya Abu Sharmuta, shu hada. Wallahi. Okay, apparently they can't parry this dagger. I, I love the consistency. Sometimes I can parry, sometimes I can't climb that because, you know, in Egypt apparently people can't cr climb fences, it's haram. I don't know how that avoided me this time because I definitely dodged the same way. More traps in Egypt, that is clearly in front of you. The woman lacking clothes is here. Here comes Satya at last. Will you serve me loyally like you served us mostly before they fell? For too long, he has been the Red Pharaoh, red as a desert bringer of death and destruction. I should be the new Black Pharaoh, black as the fertile Nile soil, bringer of new life. Don't talk about your ovaries like this. We've come a long way together, Satya. Without me, the new gods will make you a puppet like they did with the former master in Avaris four centuries ago. What do you say now in the final arrow? Arrow? Uh, uh, hour. Will you help me heal the two lands? Um. Can I get you armor? That depends on the answer, yes? So it shall be. Let this be remembered as the first of our reign. Astra to the Black Pharaoh first. I hereby name Satya of Tibis, Grand Vizier of the Two Lands. Your name should be inscribed next to ours to live forever in the account of your heroic deeds. Go forth, the last trial waits. We shall summon Ishtar to keep the gods at bay while you slay our Moses. Without them, he's just a meat puppet, drunk on power and bitterness of age. Go to go. Egypt goes with you, Satya. See? They have a last minute lore decision as a trap is about to spawn. <laughs> Didn't I call it? Why do you guys look like the bad guy from the mummy? Don't you love it, enemies that can dodge your attacks? And you have no response to them? Nice iframes game. Again, I'm not sure exactly how... The shield mechanic works because it doesn't make any sense that a big shield blocking a small dagger attack loses 50% stamina. And yeah, I'm pretty much dead here because I have nothing to heal with. Do I enjoy this game? No, it's like it's been on my hard drive forever. I thought it was gonna be like a serious game that I can review and, you know, do stuff with it. And then I'm like, oh, wait, you can't even do a magic build because I think, I think magic just immediately runs out. 
And there's no way to refill up magic. And big weapons are unbearable. Yeah, but yeah, there's gonna be an ambush soon, isn't there? Um... Egyptians were into big mummy golems, weren't they? Oh, multiple mummy golems. Of course, kill the wicker. Thank you, that was my plan, actually. Shapti Sword. Ooh! My name! Um. So, why is it all heavy weapons? It seems like all the latest weapons are heavy, I don't know why. Oh, hey, handsome. With the skinny legs. I write, that is all I do, but I'm no miscribe. Behold all the great and despicable people you have encountered. High priestess, brave soldiers, terrible enemies, I'm nothing like them. I write, but in stone, what I write, men remember, men whose grandmothers have yet to be born. Then by the end of this very day, I remember your name, and then it shall be remembered forever. Millenniums hence, when Egypt shall be nothing but a vague memory of glory. Whatever sunset I've heard you praise in a thousand throats, why then you shall go unnamed in that final fight, as most of us do. I'm Iram, friend. Just a chisel monger, and you today at last light I'll decide who you are. Okay. But a little bit full of yourself? I'm sorry, you're gonna judge me how you're gonna write me if I die or live? How about I decapitate you? Mommy Golems are back. Thank you, Mommy Golem. That's a hitbox, right? Or is that the idea of a hitbox? Were all the Shapti gears like this? Why am I using the dingy knife that's actually good, but like it's it doesn't have a cool name? Again, I was just about to say, is this gonna be an ambush? Is a big one gonna attack? Look at that finely sculpted, like, round ass on this golem. Yeah, don't use the heavy attacks. Uh, uh. Um, what was? Yep, those are hitboxes, right? Um, sorry. Camera, hi. Yeah, camera, can you like, you know, just... For Pete's sake, man, can you like just look at what is happening on the screen? The camera, the camera takes too long to react to anything. It, it, it's like, you know, you know the, those people who are like, who are like at lingerie shows for Dolce Gabbana on fashion TV or whatever, they're just filming. And then a model with a nice ass comes on screen and the camera just falls down there. That's exactly what I feel like. This this camera is is way too slow. The, the camera basically does... It, you know, it's, it, it sees something, it's just focusing on that as the ambush happens here. Yeah, that's exactly... Mm -hmm. That's exactly what I wanted to look, didn't I? Oh, boy. I'm even holding my breath here. Um. Huh? What is this? Why is it like dead end? Am I supposed to get lost in this empire here? By the way, where am I? Never mind. Uh, Legs of Istar. Um, don't you think there's a point of diminishing returns at a certain point? <laughs> Sorry, you could you could see his his nanomolecules were working over time trying to understand what to do here. Yeah, just just you know, have to go in there, can't sidestep that. It it feels like it feels like there's effective ways to, you know, close off gaps for players. 
something like, I don't know, a magical gate, for example. I don't know, I believe if you put a magical gate, that is fine, honestly. Um, hello? I remember you! The prisoner is set mod! I was in the next cell, I saw you what you did, the guards went all crazy that they managed to escape in confusion! That I escaped was a blessing enough, but horror seeing you again here, that's a divine sign. Here, a little token of my gratitude, stranger, please accept it. Shop the jam. I've been looking at the Red Pharaoh's coffers and I'm on my way to Libya, or wherever the barbarians haven't arrived yet. You'd be well advised to do the same while you can. And it's not like, you know, Libya is up. Near the... I mean, I guess Libya... I guess Libya was mostly for the Romans. Sorry, I'm trying to apply logistical... You know, historical events that... <laughs> Oh, fuck your mom is here, man. Ambush. But I don't know if I cleared out this area. No, I didn't. Sorry, my bad. I'm not a bad gamer. Sorry for being so quiet, honestly. It's... The game, the game has very sticky controls, they're not flexible at all, so I have to focus a lot to know my timings down. Or maybe I'm getting old, I don't know. Oh, shut the fuck up, you sh- you dick golem. Why is there fire in front of us? What's with the kung fu here? Oh, like a blade dancer of- Can you stop dancing all over my grave, thanks? A cellar inside the temple. Where's Jesus to kick your ass out? What? I have nothing to speak with you. Move along. Psst. I'm going to for you. I got spying and spying after someone on the kids to set my prison for the rest of my life. All right. We could arrange something, but it's going to be worth the risk for me. Uh, 5,000 cadet, huh? By fine horse, but make haste. You're not of deserters. No need to make excuses, friend. May come pawn spears, pet violets, cuirasses, long skirts. Not to be worried about love. War is lost and we all know it. The Red Fire has lost favor with God. That much is clear. By a new pharaoh or sea people king? True, go on, and so shall, shall I do. What are you selling, stranger? Indifferent cartographer. Blade of the Palace Guard. Dagger of the Palace Guard. Minus 25 damage, but like... No, that is too much, I think. That would be a good fit. Holy Labricks. Oh my god. Okay, so the sword was not special. What the fuck do I do with that pack pack? rings another kept promise and they ran out of ideas here this is where the developers just just rushed in the game to get something out try heavy weapon do i have any gem like how many gems do i have i have six gems so technically i can max out technically i can max out one more skill also apparently the enemies can like read my inputs because if I press backwards while I'm attacking them, it seems like, um... Uh, it seems like they'll dodge less, they won't respond to me... Well, except there. I don't know why my character was trying to aim to the guys with the full HP on the side. But yeah, apparently they... I, I don't know why this is happening, I don't know if this is just a placebo effect or something. But every time I'm pushing forward, or just trying to attack them normally, the enemies seem to be dodging me like crazy if I press away from the enemy. Thoughts of Ishtar. Is that a piece of armor? Uh, can I think about Ishtar? I got Ishtar on my mind. Thoughts of Ishtar. Did I get Ishtar armor? Um, are you sure these are the right colors to have the armor set on? They I just love it. A, a game about like Egyptian stuff. There's a million armors you could make Egyptian style, and they decide to go with World of Warcraft. This game, you know the, the quality of this game, what it reminds me of? It reminds me of, like, Wolves of Midgard, that... That Diablo-like game I played, like, I think a year ago or something? It reminds me exactly of that game. Like, 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 uh, the developers have a chance of, like, making some awesome Viking armor for the game. Instead, they decide to go full World of Warcraft on my ass with the armor sets. I mean, you think they'll put in, like, a belly dancer outfit or something? No. Oh, look, another twat that is lost in life. Oh, no, those two rocks. This is worse than Dark Souls 2, honestly. This is embarrassing at this point. 
Words of Osiris. Uh, it looks very fancy. This has man invokes fire from the other life straight towards the enemy. No, it's an offensive one. I don't want to use those. I'm not doing a magic build. Behold, stranger, what was the grand nation? All this splendor, nine ruins. In olden times, this was the grandest temple in the world. Now it's a gutter fit only for pigs. You know why Slayer of Kings? Because kings, precisely. That's the use of pyramids. Why build monoliths when you c what comes from stellas and tombs and all this pride of monarchs? Not. If you really want to deliver us, not change one tyrant for another, Satya. Get my talisman. It's over there. Deliver us from Amosis and leave us alone. Lands ruin themselves or perish. Be gone now. I must write things down. Huh? There's a third optional ending? Like, this the, the super secret good ending if you want to play this game even more? Ambush? Is it the one that I cleared or not? I'm sorry, everything looks the same, honestly, at this point to me. Oh no, this is not the one I cleared, I think. Boy. I'm sorry, it's not over? Um. <laughs> well, see, maybe if every single attack that I do is not fucking trash. And maybe all of my attacks were not fucking trash, I could do something, but they are. Um, um, let me, let me build up my, my heavy, heavy weapons and see the stamina cost to take value. Because the annoying part about this game, the annoying part about this game is like, you can't see the default stats of what you might get or you might not get. You can't see that. You can't see that. Also, apparently Egyptians are scared of a little bit of water to cross the other ledge. Oh no, not her. Please tot go my way. Ah, oh, you slag. Everything is big weapons, I don't understand. Okay, heavy weapons. Let's invest all our gems in that. Yeah, I did it, and I have two left over. I can technically upgrade my light armors now and max it out. Okay, so let's say... Okay, forget about attack speed. Actually, you know what? Let me calculate attack speed into the default damage. If I double the damage here with my buff... This is like, what, about 500? Um, yeah, sure, let's go, I guess. At this point, I don't know. Yeah, this, but then there's the attack speed. I, I hate that part. Can I get more heals? If, if you can, I've literally... This honestly doesn't seem good. Without the buff? How come this is not deleting them? Okay, let me pick up the Minotaur Sword or whatever it's called. I, I want I want to see like the, the, the strongest one hit possible. What is it gonna be? Mashallah with the balance of this game. Mashallah. I mean, I guess technically it is better because... Assuming I don't miss. It, it, it still stuck, sucks though. Without the buff, it sucks. Uh, 10,000. 
Okay, I can only swing this like once or twice. Yes. Okay, I need a test dummy now. Ambush. No, okay, okay, let me go upstairs and do the ambush. I mean, by the time I swing, I'm already dead, and that character would have been dead by now with a faster weapon. And I'm thinking about using the the, the fast ring or whatever it's called. But, but you know, like, if you don't have the stamina to sustain it, what are you gonna swing at? That's it? Okay. I'll also test out something. What about this ring? Would this ring of Taurus, like, would it work on... On big weapons only, maybe? No, Ring of Tarus does not work. Let me let me try the sword. Because it does say sword on the, you know, like technically. Oh, it's a sword. Oh, it's a sword, guys. It's a sword. Remember that. The captain used a sword to defeat Eva, so it's the sword that gets only the buff. I honestly have no idea because I've like like the nothing works, nothing shows information to me. Oh, fuck off. You know that they don't hit me, right? I honestly think the iframes don't work. I think the iframes is based upon where your character is, which defeats the entire point of iframes in a game like this. You know, maybe, maybe the sword isn't such a bad idea. Okay, what's your plan? <laughs> oh, fuck off! There was oh, fuck off! Yeah, no, there is something wrong with this game's um, hitboxes. There is definitely something wrong. Um, there, there's something happening with the, what, like when you're inside the body or something. I don't know how to explain it. L like, like I think, I think the hitboxes do work, and I think the col oh, fuck off! Honestly, this is a bad game at this point. Are you... Are you kidding me? Damn. Okay, the women golem are weaker than the... I'm out of... I'm out of heals again. Oh, for Pete's sake, man. Okay, what's your plan? What, the, the man gives up behind a woman? Okay, so now he attacks when I had an entire routine planned down. So this is why even though the big weapons are bad DPS relationship... Because they can't even stun with one hit? Unless you use the heavy attack? Because enemies can also dodge. Everything about this is very bad. Yeah. Very good game, guys. Very good game, guys. Very good game. Excellent game. Everything sucks. Nothing does damage. There is no value to anything that you do in the game. Excellent game, guys. Excellent game. Bravo. I hope your parents are proud of you making a game like this. Yep, that's a hitbox. Okay, guys, why do you even have heavy weapons in the game if, like, the common enemies can... Do you guys just not know how to make games or something? Oh no, you have to parry, that's how you do it. You have to parry, you have to learn how to parry. With one block on a big shield, I take 50% of my stamina damage. What the fuck are you supposed to do about that? Yep, yep, yep. 
yep, good game, good game, bravo, good game, good game, get see brain damage, you know, with free healthcare is not possible in your country. I'm being so mean, but honestly, guys, like, like, let the player finish your game at the end of the day. Oh, now you'll work, look, bitch, look to the other side. Where's the archer? There was no archer this time. These are not hitboxes, guys. Fix your hitboxes before you publish a game. A, a tiny dagger do does more stun damage than, than a big sword. How the fuck does that even happen? Sorry, how the fuck did you even aim to the left when I was pressing to the right? <sighs> I mean, I don't even know what's the point of the lock-on. The game does not need to have a lock-on. The game has no reason to have a lock-on. You know, if, if the game if the game required enemies that are flying or something to have a lock-on, and you're playing an archery build or a magic build or something like that, I'll understand that. But it doesn't. It's just left and right. The player just moves their, their keyboard left or right, and that is where you look. And that's it. There is no reason for the soft lock-on. Is there a guy in front of me? Thank you. Oh my god. My tiny dagger stuns enemies, but nothing else does. Guys, guys, this is not how you make a game. You can't make a game like this where the enemies can randomly spawn. Either to the left or to the right, the camera doesn't show anything, the camera literally doesn't react to the area being spawned. It just has everything off-screen. Number- guys, number one rules of video game, if you're gonna off-screen a player, then you need to have the enemy's AI be, be smaller. You need the enemy's AI to be less aggressive, they kind of forgot about that. Dark Souls can do that because it's a 3D game, it's not locked by all these limitations. What a terrible game! Is he gonna spawn there? No, he didn't. Oh, now he did, except the show. Oh, look, the, now the golem is there as well. I bet the developers are those kinds of people who are like, Oh, look at this strategy. Oh, fuck you, man, honestly. You guys don't know how to make a... You guys seriously don't know how to make a game. Everything about this game is annoyance and nuisance. Everything is a nuisance. I don't know what this was their idea. There's a reason people don't like in Dark Souls 2, you not being able to go through fog gates because of limitations and the enemy could backstab you. There is a reason that died off. But these developers were very proud of that idea. That's not a hitbox. No, wait, I shouldn't fight her because I don't have my buff, because nothing does damage. And then, just keep on stun-locking an enemy with my tiny... dagger. By the time my character... By the time my character... By the time my character turns around to block with a shield, she's already turning, and because my shield is not universal around me, I still get hit with rotations. Heart of Ishtar. Honestly, it feels like armor is doing nothing, if I'm gonna be honest. It feels like I need more stamina so I can actually hit enemies. But why are you complaining so much? You know, just get good. Well, play the game and then you'll understand what the problem with the controls is. Is this not an ambush? Okay, it's a cleaned out ambush. Oh, right, it's this area. I guess this is the reason why this game doesn't even have a wiki, you know? Like, literally, there's no guides for this game. Oh, you want a certain set for your character? There is... Please, someone... See? I think the game literally does not have iframes. Or the iframes come out on a specific frame and then they just stop immediately. 
Because over there, the reason I died, I literally dodged the same way, the same timing. I, yeah, look! I, I, I literally think the reason I sometimes get hit is because they're hitting body parts on me. You know in Dark Souls games, like when you're coming out of an iframe, sometimes you die because an enemy hits your feet? Like, literally. I think it's most apparent on Smaug and Ornstein. Like, they'll sometimes literally just catch you on the feet. Like, just hit you on the toes and you die. Really, you're gonna spawn them there. That is what I feel with this game. Every time I'm dying or getting hit by something, it's because, oh, technically you are iframes, but you're not iframes, so technically you get hit. I don't know how I dodged that. I still timed it the same way. I guess my feet were not in the way or something. Okay, where did I go from here? Like this or like this? What I don't understand is why every single area is an ambush now. Well, what was it supposed to do there on the timing? You can literally see them hit me over there. You can literally see me see them hit me over there, but because I, I dodge late or whatever, that's when my iframes are coming out, even though it's not consistent at all. What was I supposed to do there? Okay, I think two dodges is safe. Fuck me, there is more? The women are the worst. Um... Okay. Uh-huh. Also, why do I have like, black lipstick? I never understood that. Egyptians were very well known for their makeup, but not to the point of black lipstick. No. I wasted the buff there. Uh, I suck. Yeah, what determines the second attack? I, is it... Don't tell me they're starting to do the Fume Knight script thing. Wait, it's like if you're in zone, they'll counter-attack. Like, but like that, like that's the thing. You can be right at the tip of it. They won't attack you. Okay, hold on, let me remember how I got up there again. How did that hit me? You can see me in the middle of my roll. Sometimes it hits, sometimes it doesn't. It's on consistency. It might be a frame time issue, I don't know. Ugh. Come on, use your bobeshes! Did it look like I was... Mm -hmm. I don't know how that missed, because I wasn't in frames. Okay, it's you and me. Oh, I did- I wasn't at all focused on the blue guy, because he didn't do any shinies. How did you miss that? Don't tell me there's more! Ah, oh, fuck me, man. 
Okay, the Kopesh one might bypass her friend. Um, why is the big guy at the back, like, so confused? Oh my god, how did that not hit me? I forgot at the last stupid fucking second this stupid game has fucking Sekiro moves which you can't block and they're not grabs. So since this is the case, I'm getting barely one hit in, I need something slightly fast and uh, hard hitting, so speed doesn't matter at this point. By all means, just shit all over my head. Also, I don't know why, but I have a really f strange feeling that like maybe level 30, like those old school games, might be the cap. Because it seems very hard to level up, not level up specifically, just... Why did I do that? There's like four, four routes here. I was right! I was right, I was 100% right, the hitboxes are completely desynced from the body. Oh my god, I feel so happy that I was right. Because for a while there, I thought I was going crazy. I was like, am I that bad of a gamer? How am I randomly getting hit? I just proved that. I literally was trying to dodge there, and you can literally see his, his hand was nowhere near me and it hit me. So even if you know when to dodge, even if you know when to dodge with your character, if you're in the wrong place with the giant hitboxes that they have on the enemies, it, it feels like it feels like my character needs to have more iframes than this. If you guys are not gonna put in the effort for the hitboxes, you guys need to give the player a lot more iframes. Oh yeah, by all means, just attack off screen. Perfect. Oh my god. Oh my god, the lack of damage on anything that doesn't have the Anubis buff is fucking ridiculous, honestly. Maybe this sword is slightly better? Again, that ri I, I don't understand the iframes on that one. Like, my iframes are barely existent. I'll say I have no idea why I have even the shield equipped, honestly. Hold on, I need the extra water here. Feel like also maybe allowing the player to upgrade their heals would be also an idea. I... I can't see the trap, my guys! You guys suck at making games! You guys don't know the basics of video games, it's not that hard, honestly! People say making games is hard, they should go back to collecting bags of cement in the middle of the street for like under minimum wage and then they can shut the fuck up! There are children in Africa that pick up your coffee and they don't even taste it, so shut the fuck up! What are you aiming at? Yeah? Hit me while you're starting the attack this time. Yeah, no, guys, fuck your game, honestly. That missed me? Why does every attack need catch, man? Especially with... Guys, you honestly suck at making games, you don't know how to make games, so like, never in your life make games again, man. 
Yep, that missed me for some reason. I wasn't dodging, I wasn't doing anything. I don't know. How did that hit me? Everything just sucks in this game. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, honestly. I is the sword slower? Oh, it's slower as well. Oh, sorry, my bad. Okay, how about the Kopesh? Like, like, just maximum speed on everything, honestly. I think it requires more stamina or something. I'm not sure. What a trashy, shitty game, honestly. I'm getting mad. <laughs> you have no idea, man. You have no idea. Just, just honestly download and play this game to get the feeling as to what I'm talking about. Because it's always hard to explain controls to a person. But the thing is, I'm pretty sure normal, normal people, you know, like let's say a doctor that just wants to play games to enjoy life... You know, like, for example, that trap over there. Th that trap over there, for example. Oh, fuck off. That didn't hit me. I was in my iframes. That that trap over there, like, every single trap you have to dodge. I don't know why that's necessary. Why a player can't simply run by the trap or, like, just casually dodge? You have to be perfect. Is also extremely, like, stupid. I'm sorry, they're all here? Yeah? That attack is so much bullshit, honestly. No! Why I'm not fast enough to hit her the last time! Also, why doesn't level up give me, like, like, reheals me and stuff? Well, it doesn't matter what I want because that Kopesh bitch is here. Fuck, man. Why not go with the big weapons? Because as I already said, they fucking suck with their attack speed. They absolutely are terrible. Okay, you know what? You want me to use this? Okay, le let's, let's go full damage. Let's even go the Ring of Taurus. Even though the Ring of Taurus literally does not work. I like to imagine... I'm, I'm sorry that they don't hit her because she was... I'm sorry, the enemies attack sometimes have iframes? Oh boy, this is such a bad game. Oh, yeah, no, fuck this game, man. It's not fun at all. You suck, honestly. You suck. Okay, l let's even ring use the Ring of Taurus. I mean, the Ring of Taurus does not work. It literally does not work. It's broken. I mean, if it does, it provides, like, what, 10% more damage? 10% more damage does not show up unless you're using Anubis' thing. Anubis' seal. Oh, look, that should have hit me, but apparently that was the eye from there at the last second. What the fuck, man? Okay. Why not? Look okay, at this disgusting Mega Man set that doesn't make any sense. Uh, but yeah, let's go. The other blue shield on me. I don't know why my set looks like two Power Rangers trying to have a baby, but we became out deformed. So I think this is the best set or something? What's the set like? I have 370 defenses. That's like 50 more. It doesn't really matter. But yeah, sure, let's go. But yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's uh, go.
This sucks, man. Does my entire stamina just get deleted? Well, I'm dead. Oh, fuck. Okay, shield. Shield breaking me. The buff fin. The buff finished right as I was. The buff finished right as I was about to hit them or whatever. Oh my god, game, you suck. Like, stop buying yourself some time. This is the end, no? This is, this is literally at the end of the game. What the fuck are you buying time for exactly? You fucking cunt, man. Your game is not that impressive that you need to buy time at the end of the game. Like, get over yourselves. Oh no, our game might be uh, tr four hours long. People might not be able to return it. We gotta make sure people don't return it. Oh no, we gotta make sure about that. God, is that why there isn't even a single review of your game, huh? Sorry, I'm being very mean, but honestly, man, fuck this. What's even the point of the armor? If it's not gonna protect you against anything. Also, I like how apparently if they break me out of the armor, like, like out of, you know, blocking with my shield, I take the damage that we're supposed to do. I, I just love that. So armors that don't block anything? Oh, fuck you, man. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna start cheating in the game, man. <laughs> this is so much bullshit because I literally don't have enough stamina to dodge all of those. Yeah, woman attack. Uh huh. I don't know that's missing bit, but I'm so happy it is. One, two. Oh my god, thank fucking Christ, holy shit. I mean, Osiris or... You know what, noob is, fuck this at this point. See, it wasn't that hard, just get good. Well, it's not comfortable at all, huh? I'm not fighting the Apex bosses here. These are just, just enemies inside... Don't tell me another ambush. Oh, this twat is here. La, I have seen you in my dreams, Satya, the slayer of Oannes. After you distract face, I saw the errors in my way. Why is our princess being conserved the king? I've been the Red Pharaoh's advisor. I've told him to expect you. Go on ahead, love the chambers of the Red Pharaoh. I shall not stop you. I'm this has been useful for a while, but the powers I serve you are all the same. Him, Astarte, even you. My master will still rule the aeons when the pyramids become dust and all forgotten. Allah, Allah. Is there going to be a safe point inside here, or do I need to do all that again? Throne of the two lands. What happened to the one lands? Oh, I can teleport here if I want. Wow, what a nice game. What a good game. Very good. Mashallah, Sharmuta. Um, okay. Since this is my current situation, I'm gonna guess like getting the earrings or something just does nothing for me, honestly. Um, so let me go back here and just, I guess, fully upgrade my... my small weapons. Honestly, what a terrible color combination for this armor. What the fuck were they thinking? Make it all, all like, like pink or whatever, like, like fuchsia. Oh, small weapons are done. Oh, right, light armor then. They're a mix. Looks much better than whatever trash I was wearing previously. Also, do you bet there's a secret ending to this game or something? Look how much better this set is! What the fuck was that other set about? Okay, yeah, let's go back to Kopesh just in case. You know, you never know. Also, do I have a better looking shield? Like fashion? I mean, this works honestly, since... You know... I mean, this proves exactly my point. This game is so badly designed. Because you essentially have a shield that you can parry with. 
the parry barely works because of the damage frame attack frames of that, because of the wonky hitboxes. But the best part about all of that, the best part, even if you use a shield to block, every single attack, you have secure attacks that you can't dodge. Not dodge, sorry, you can't block. You have super attacks. Everything hits so hard in the game that the shields are useless. It's better to keep on learning how to dodge. Th that's basically how it is. Is why I fight Bubon Common. What is that supposed to symbolize? A Moses the first, Red Pharaoh, master of the two lands. Okay. Is that supposed to symbolize something? Yeah, I was about to say, do you think he has an explosion? Do you think he's confused that his local guards are attacking him? He's like, why is one of my local guards attacking me? Well, this is deceptively easy. Is there like three phases to this boss? There's three phases, isn't it? Okay, wait, before I do that, I'm very close to leveling up. I'm very close to leveling up. Let me just level up, I guess. Leveled up, baby. Level 30. I don't know why, but I think that's going to be the last level. I have a very strong feeling like the max cap is level 30, which is a very weird choice for a game like this. But there's one way to find out. I should still be leveling up right now. Um, I don't get any XP. Usually you, you at least see a couple of pixels of pink there. Or like purple. Okay, interesting choice to make the max level. Interesting choice to make the max level 30 in a game like this. Why? I, I don't feel like they're the plan for this game. I think they just made big ass ladies in Egypt. With like a lot of sexy clothes and that's about it. I think that's all they did. I don't think they had the plan. Why is it level 30? Why is there a limited amount of Shabdi gems? I mean... Is it like, what happens if it... Wait, does this game even have New Game Plus? Do you think this game has New Game Plus? I have a feeling it won't. Also, why have magic if you can't make a magic build properly? Explosion? That hit me? Oh, see, he has all the skill of his allies. Um. Are you shitting me? Behind? Oh, wait. Huh? <laughs> um, that orb was right inside me, did nothing. Okay, it's doing a lot, actually. Pink! Pink! Oh yeah, I should, I should dodge on that one. Bing! Oh, that was it? Holy!
Holy shit, it was so much easier than the bosses. Uh, sorry, not the boss. I'm even calling the other guys the bosses than like the normal guys. Can't break the vases of the empire? The final boss was easier. Okay, so the final boss was easier than the golem fight. Which was, which broke every single rule up till then about the game. The last boss fight was, was easier than gangbangs. The final boss, by the way, there's some statues of women back under men that have big titties. Just want to point that out. Um, the last boss was also easier than the snake lady because she was very finicky. She was very badly designed. It feels like either, either, I, I don't know, whatever, man. It feels like all the boss fights should be should have been on this level or slight or this boss fight should have been slightly harder. To the Black Pharaoh because we're racist, mistress of the two lands, all life, prosperity, and health. In her first year of reign, Astrata One drove the sea people from the walls of TVs and pursued them into the sea, just where they belong. Look at me with my sparkles. With Queen Circe dead, the invaders retreated, never to be seen again. In three years of her reign, the new gods were banned in Egypt. So are we a harem? Grand Vizier Satya was appointed to rebuild Avaris as the seat of the cult of Ishtar, from where the daughters proceeded as sole religious authority in the two lands. In the year 12 of her reign, the Black Pharaoh reincarnated for the first time. It's all a scam and it all started again. In the year 13 of her reign, Satya renounced all titles and honors and disappeared from all records into exile once again. Because now I'm fighting my friend. In the year 15 of her reign, the Oracle of Varys prophesied the return of Satya and the liberation of the two lands again, because everything is a cycle. From the inscriptions of Irem. How can people see you all the way from down there? By the way, those are JPEG trees. Pharaoh Nick! A Milkstone Studios. Uh, from Milkstone Studios. Game designed by Alejandro Gonzalez and Miguel Herrero. Oh, you're right. It might be a Portuguese or s character design Santiago or, or Zac or Rosco. I, I can tell someone was very focused on the O's in the game. Why Egypt? Why not Spain? I guess in Spain you can't have sexy outfits of slaves. <laughs> Look at all the people in chains going to the pyramid. Uh, writer Victor Ojuel. Um, there's a problem about that, which is that all the lore is such verbal diarrhea all over the place by random NPCs that you basically end up not caring about it. And that's it, that's the number of studio. Okay, so what happens if I do, for example, continue? There's no new game plus? Also, once I make my choice, I can't rechange it? What happens if I do new game? Oh, this is it. The guy from the mummy. Well, G to the G. Thank you so much, Pharaonic. Um, Pharaonic, a game from Spain, I think, about Egyptians fighting for their liberation. How big was the game? The game was 1.21 gigabytes. That is technically fine. Um, yeah, it's fine. So let me take a look at the files. Not too far into the game, you started having this problem like with the wonky hitboxes, this and that. As far as I can tell, nothing is really assets except maybe a few animations here and there, which is fine. Spiders, wolves, curses, crocodiles, the pharaoh statues, and the little women. Ha! Estato tio! Estato tia! Uncle and aunt! I'm sorry, you're calling the big naked titty statues your aunt? Guys, do you want to talk about something? I wouldn't call them aunt or uncle. Big chat, dick energy, uncle and aunt. See, she's hiding on her boobs. She's very shy. The aunt is very shy. Oh. <laughs> uh, Statua Anubis. Statue of Anubis. Look at this big doggo. Uh, <laughs> Sphinx with a, with a head. <laughs> what is this? A hummingbird? Tot. This is Tot. This was Tot all along. Goddamn Tots, man. Heads. Balcone. Uh... Cetro Pharaon, like Pharaon Scepter. Well, yeah, there's nothing really special to say. You saw what you saw. What about, like, the textures? I mean, we already saw some of the textures. Uh, what about, like, extra on them? Artwork, yada yada yada, it's fine. Although I like how over time the artwork got worse. Uh, well, you know, for Vaz. Okay, so almost everything is 1k textures. I don't know why they did that. And then, like, 5k, uh, five, 500. Oh, all the enemies as well. 
Look at the tits on the golems. What's even the point of that golem girl? Oh my, I like how it's golem clever girl. This one is called clever girl. I don't know why. Gigantic, gigantic. Cleaver. Men don't have names. Men don't have names, but women must have names. <laughs> this golem has lips. Lizard man. Um, everything is packed in a giant g g bakery. What's this? <laughs> it's the snake boss. Look at this piece of ass. Literally, they even gave her a small bump just in case you might be confused it's female or not. Um, what is this? Oh, the, oh, the, the Circe. Uh, Circe, except, um, you know, no boobs, but again, with the ass. We got focus with the ass. Good for you, Ontario. Or whatever the guy's name was that are some of the zombies, like, heroin? Oh, this is us. With our jiggle physics. Let's clean armor. Oh, oh, wait. They, oh, I can sort it by containers. Joya! Joya! Happiness. When you say equipment, what do you mean by equipment? Oh, weapons. Okay, all these weapons. I, I definitely do recognize them. Oh my god, are you serious? Oh my god, I think... I think you could get some unique weapons or unique armor, I think, in the game. Like, like bosses, I, I think they wanted the player to have access to pretty much all these weapons, but then I think they... What the fuck is this? Mace Assyrian. Heavy Sword Assyrian. Ishtar Shield. Oh, I'm sorry, this shield was for Ishtar? This was an Ishtar shield? The, the shield that didn't have Ishtar's name on it was for Ishtar? Hero Barba, <laughs> the beard on the characters, backpack. Yeah, these are all the backpacks that we saw. What is this? I think literally they wanted to put New Game Plus so like certain things can drop. But I think they also just at the end were like, whatever, let's just finish this. Oh my god, I think the mini bosses that you sometimes fight, they should be able to drop their items. But wait, if there's no new game plus, then you can't get the weapons and items, no? On a mini boss, like the bull dancer? Wait a second. Um, uh, le let me search bull. I like how armor mattered and didn't matter in the end. Also, I like how the jiggle physics work on every single armor for some reason. Okay, this is a missing in armor, corrupted skirt. A Syrian mini boss. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god! Yeah, no, no, this game... I'm not gonna say this is a bad game, but... Um, no, no, you're, you, you you could get it. You could get it. You can see here a girl-like leg. Okay, so let me get this straight. This is a game... It's a Souls-like where enemies can drop their loot, but also at the same time you can fight mini-bosses once. And either they'll drop money or they'll drop a random set. And as far as, as far as I can tell, you can't go to a shop and buy the sets. Um, I mean, I don't know if there's a guy that will tell you there's a shop somewhere that sells the boss armors. But I couldn't find it. They, they, definitely, they definitely had more plans for the game. But I think at the end, they were just like, we can't do it. And this is what they like put out, essentially. I think that was an option, but but then like there's mini bosses that like once you kill it's that's it. Like how are you supposed to get so, and, and you don't have new game plus to like you know in new game pluses get the other armor parts. Are you supposed to safe scum this? They just did what they could and then at like you can feel at the end they rushed it because like that NPC inside the temple, she was selling the same stuff again, like outside. Like nothing changed, so I don't know what that was about. So Pharaonic! Embark on a journey of exploration and violence in the two lands of Ibgis with Pharaonic. This unforgiving combat RPG features a streamlined and challenging combat system that keeps on your toes while fighting for your life. Very positive by 200 people bought. Released in 2016, right around when Dark Souls 3 was released. Um, honestly, this is just bullshit, honestly, guys. You have a lot of technical issues. That's the problem with the game. It's not unforgiving. I mean, it's unforgiving because you don't, like, the role is not the iframe. The iframe comes out just literally at the start. Animations desync. The closer you are to an enemy's body, their, gi their giant hitboxes connect on you. You have lingering hitboxes. It's honestly kind of a mess. The pacing, you know, like, as I said, for example, the golem. 
they don't teach you to like avoid properly or to block properly because also blocking is useless. And then with the golem, it's like, yeah, you can't roll behind them. Like there's no preparation for that. Farm together now available in early access. I'm not sure why you're advertising this on the Faronic page. White noise to available. Last update was on February 2017. They were just they were just putting out they are just putting out updates for the text uh, that's not really important, honestly. This update brings a few improvements that fix one of the most import important inconveniences with the game, having to repeat arenas where traversing already completed zones. I'm sorry. Let this sink in for a minute. In the original version of the game... Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna guarantee you one thing. These developers, they didn't play their own game. They just make difficulty for the sake of difficulty. I can guarantee you not even they legitimately finish the game without knowing how the game works and how to abuse mechanics. The reason I'm saying that is because look over here. In, in the game, apparently, originally, the arenas, the ambushes, I think that's what they're talking about, they would respawn. This means every time you're going through an area, you'd be forced into the ambush over and over again. What the fuck? We've been thinking about possible solutions to this. They don't want to remove the enemies altogether. Once you clear an arena, next time it will spawn a few enemies, but the area won't be locked anymore. This is so stupid. What the fuck were you guys thinking? No game does this. Unless you die and reload an area by like an old game, like let's say, for example, Dead Space. Unless you're fighting a boss and you keep on dying and resetting to fight the boss. This is not at all. What the fuck? This means the game has become a little easier and shorter. Oh wow, shut the fuck up. This, this game has become a little easier and shorter. No need to repeat areas. Shut the fuck up. A little easier? You guys made a terrible lock-on system, stamina system, gameplay loop, and you have, the, you have the audacity to be arrogant enough to put this sentence in? Not every arena has this feature, but all the ones that are in the main path have it. Oh wow, this is not obvious at all. How does it make any sense? Gameplay changes. Cleared arenas in the main path do not lock the player in posterior attempts. This is so painful to read. Spearman charge attack in TB's place is no longer unblockable. I'm sorry, many attacks were supposed to be unblockable, then what's the point of the shield? If 90% if of an attack of the enemy, it just deletes your shield, then what's the fucking point? Why even put in the shields? Just remove the shields then. You now get the 25% stamina boost when performing a successful Parry. You're supposed to indicate this in some capacity in the game. I mean, I mean, uh, it's fine. The game, the, like 90% of the enemies could not be parried anyways. I'm pretty sure you can't parry the giant golem attacks. So now you're telling me that this is a useless thing for what? And it doesn't even get explained in the game. Let's see, update two bug fixes. Our best wildlife water smugglers have worked hard to bring you this update. Remove three locked areas in the Halls of Stones, so traversing the area isn't as cumbersome. What the fuck is wrong with you guys? You, you didn't make this game hard. You made it annoying. Who the fuck would even want to play your game at that point? Reduce difficulty of an arena in the city of Tibis. Fix save game handling issues. Fantastic. In a Souls-like game having save game issues. Fantastic. Fix stamina getting reset on level up. This should not have your biggest concern. This, If a player levels up during combat and they don't have control over how they're leveling up, let them restore their stats, like their HP and stamina. Like you like you guys are focusing too much on, on balance that doesn't exist in the game in the first place. This is a perfect example of how developers focus on, on difficulty on the game rather than the fun aspect or the balance aspect. If enemies have giant hitboxes that hit you if you're close to their body, that should be a bug fix, not this. This should be the last thing you fix. Improvements. Conflict inputs are automatically clear when binding keys. At the loading screen, after mixed on logo. Um, too bad. Too bad because the game is 32-bit. If, if, if your PC loses focus on the game, the game can literally just stop loading and, and soft lock. Plenty of overall improvements. Define this. Added a teleport in the final area. Oh my god, guys, guys, this is all basic stuff you should have thought about. Just because you know how to play your own game doesn't mean other people are going to go through the files to find out how you play editing. Done some performance improvements. 
Increased parry window for both light and heavy shields. Your hitboxes and timing suck. Especially from the direction the enemy is looking at you at and how they're moving. It's barely functional and you think this is good timing? Increased dodge window. A bit when dodging in places or rolling forward. That's not the problem. You have bad hitboxes. Everything else is bad about this. How is this biggest concern? Receiving damage from an un unblockable hit will now stun you. Guys. <laughs> fix the enemies first before you touch the player. What is wrong with you? Reduce Lapis Helmet's depends from 50 to 30. It was a bug. Shut the fuck up. It's not a bug. You guys don't know how to make a game. Reduce difficulty of the last combat in the palace. I'm sorry. At first you're gonna fight 16 golems. Before reaching the pharaoh. Increase difficulty of the final boss. Increase 15% more health. Increase health of spawned golems. Increase attack variety. Increase damage of some attacks. Increase the bit attack rate. Make the boss more interesting to fight. These, these stats... These stats mean nothing. Also... It's, you know, this is what I mean. Instead of focusing on the golem spawning that is completely useless, take this, the golem, the golem stuff, and add it to the boss. J just add it to the boss. What the fuck is even the, the ads thing, honestly? It's so old school, it's not fun. Bug fixes. All the teleport not working properly and not counting towards the achievement. Fix not getting the proper ending. Um, uh, yeah, because, you know, just having one text of line at the end of the game definitely ver verifies as ending. Fix some sound in the cutscenes, ignoring volume settings. Fixed errors on Linux. Okay, whatever. Oh, it was in early access for a while. I'm sorry, your game... Your game was in early access for, like, 14 updates? Okay, I'm not reading all these updates, man, whatever. I just want to see the last update before early access. Um, the update includes the fight with the final boss and three endings. We don't spoil them, so go find them yourselves. Without a wiki. Uh, we also have done lots of gameplay and difficulty improvements after our final testing. Enemy archers have another own moveset. Improved camera behavior when standing still. No, not really. Add the number of deaths on load games still. Okay, whatever. Enemies before the wall golem are now a bit easier. The problem isn't the war golems, the problem is that you're stopping the player from getting to the boss. Just having two tanky enemies that won't let you go to the boss directly and waste your time is not fun. Honest reduced damage a bit. She does so much damage and she has, she has so much range. A reduced bit of damage does nothing. You can now attack block early after a dodge. Oh wow, I'm so privileged, thank you. Several vast changes. Increased penu... Penamoon difficulty. What's Penamoon? Increased death experience penalty. You can still recover if you get back to where you died. It it feels like if you guys... I, it feels like the entire game is balanced around like losing only a part of your experience, not all of it, like in a Souls-like. Which is why there's like a lot of bullshit mechanics in the game. Fix weapon attack speed by speed changing pank speed as well. Fix an issue with two chest load query. Fix an issue with some shortcuts showing close even when open. Although it seems like your patches were coming out fast, so I don't think your early access is actually early access. I think you do that thing where you have a previous early access of the game, you have a bunch of patches ready, you just tweak some numbers and you claim it as improvement when the game was already complete. You just pretended you're doing work. Original and streamlined combat system, not really, it's not original. There are plenty of games that did this style of gameplay. I don't know what's original about this. Get ready for the challenge. Again, all verbal diarrhea here. Farnick takes the excellent combat design of Dark Souls and adapts it to a faster paced side-scrolling environment. No, actually your game is slower than Dark Souls 1, so shut the fuck up. Use your shield to block and parry incoming attacks that don't work. Manage your stamina. It barely works. Defeat your enemies. A single mistake can fatal because you can get stun locked. So stay on your toys to avoid any making any mistakes. Or you can just use a dagger to stun lock the enemies. Explore an ancient Egypt full of traps. Blah, 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 blah. Um, nothing to say, honestly. If a person likes this game, whatever. This person apparently never played the Souls like in their life because they're literally complaining about um, about the you know the Dark Souls mechanic of reviving enemies. So I don't know why they're playing this game honestly. 
Um, lots of different weapons, armors, blah, blah, blah. They don't matter because they're all just numbers. They don't have even different movesets. Yeah, because it's not a good game. I don't know why this guy's having a verbal diarrhea. Fantastic art. Don't know what you're talking about, honestly. It's generic as it comes. You're just interested in the women, Zoe. Don't even pretend for a second. Yeah, whatever. A lot of people like this game. I mean, well, it, you know, it's their poison, whatever. It's, it's, it, let them do whatever they want. Let's see what, what rule 34 people are asking for. Um, why do enemies play a different rule than me? Um, yeah, this is actually a thing. Enemies can, like, offshot you from the screen. They can shoot you from the screen. Um, enemies have also rolling attacks. Enemy immediately recover their poise, all that kind of stuff. Uh, the parry window is terrible. Um, yeah, this is this is definitely right because depending on which direction the enemy is looking at you, the parry window just doesn't honestly work. I don't know what's up with that. I, I literally will sometimes try three different timings to parry instantly. A little delay, a longer delay, and it doesn't matter. Because again, if you're close to the boss, the hitbox will hit you before even the parry. You can react to it. Um, it's impossible to get boss sets. But yeah, apparently this is true. Apparently, the unique boss sets, you can only get one drop or zero or one, or like gold. I don't even know why there's an option to drop them. I don't know what how they fucked that up. Um, War Golem. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Um, so yeah, this person is saying the exact same thing I said, which is the War Golem introduces game mechanics that are not at all explained. That are abusive, that it keeps on spamming. Uh, the war golem is such a difficulty spike that it breaks the rules of the game until then, and the player is expected to keep on dying and experimenting with two annoying golems that block you from running to the boss so you can actually fight the real problem, the real boss. And whoever this guy is, they think they're hot shit, and they apparently are trying to show off that they won against the golem. It's like when people are like, also, it's like when people are like, uh, oh, you know, I slept only eight hours yesterday. Oh, yeah, I slept for four hours. And then your other friend is like, yeah, I only slept for one hour. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> you know, that's not a good thing. Who are you impressing? What's so impressive about saying you slept worse than your friends? Let's go to number two. Yeah, they're still, they're still complaining. Heavy builds are pointless. Heavy builds are pretty bad because of the speed, yada, yada, yada. Oh, here's the developer. Wagman. <laughs> the War Golem has roughly a 40 to 50% chance of his next attack being a charge if he's on either board of the arena. 20% of the path length. It varies depending on the other attack conditions are met as well. Outside of that 20%, chances of charge around 10 if you're within the distance, 12 meters. What the fuck is 12 meters? Guys! The stomp attack, the one that causes rocks for from sitting, has high priority too. Around 3% if you're closer than 2.5 meters. What the fuck is this? And why is it using a ranged attack when you're close to him? But he said not to do it twice in a row. No, you lied. It does it, it, does it sometimes four times in a row. You, you goddamn... Um, congratulations. They made a game where you can get stun locked in a corner, apparently. Let that sink in for a minute. 50% chance it might do the running attack. <laughs> Nemesis says, you don't play your own game, apparently. Sorry if it sounds silly. So, yeah, no, I agree. I agree with Nemesis. No, this is the perfect example of someone who legitimately did not play their game. Because, because they made the game, they would know all the secrets, you know? They would know all the chances, all the secrets, all the modifiers, all of that. They would know that. That is not an excuse. Just upload a video where I defeat the golem with a level 10 character. Levels don't matter. What the fuck are you talking about? Light armor and shield and heavy weapon. Uh, level 2 on the tree skills. The boss is designed to be level 11 to 12 characters. The boss makes a charge twice. It's true that the one on the right side took a wall, but it's not his attacks that can be avoided or blocked, so it wasn't the issue. The attacks have giant hitboxes with giant lingering boxes. What the fuck are you talking about? Um, let's see. Let's see the last person to answer this question. Oh my god, everybody's just having a verbal diarrhea. Everyone is having a review, you know, whatever. I already said all the bad stuff, especially the nuisance of trying to, like, find uh, all the NPC. And because there's so many NPCs that are having a verbal diarrhea, the NPCs have a verbal diarrhea, and there's so many of them that it's, like, 
whatever. You, you know, like, whatever, I don't care at this point. Who are you? I forgot already where is that NPC that I needed. Is there any work on the wiki? Um, apparently, they're looking for something. They can't find it. The developer comes in and they're like, there's no work on the wiki, but if anyone wants to start one, we'll be glad to provide any information needed. Not like you guys also have the wrong information for your own game. War Golem, another person complaining about the War Golem. Sad Boy Mommy Issues. Sad Boy Mommy Issues says, how are you spending your gems? There's, no, there's currently no way to respect gems. Oh my god. You need to set up your basics, man, before you make a game. Restoring mana. You know, you can't restore mana. Offensive spells are useless because of that. They they really they really just rushed in making the game. I don't even know what was the point of the game, honestly, at a certain point. <laughs> GPU still hot. Yes. This game has a problem where even if capped at 60 frames, it's using like 90% of any GPU. I don't know what the fuck that's about. Is is the Talry's ring working? No. I agree with C's, the Tauri's ring is not working. I tried with big weapons, I tried with a sword, I tried everything. The damage must be tiny, like less than 10%, because I literally can't see the difference on the screen between the attacks, even, even heavy or normal. And uh, the developer again uh, says a, a thing that no developer should say about their game. The, the snake lady, apparently it's a, it's a bad boss, someone's complaining about it. And their answer is, Oh, and this is a hard boss without a proper shield because her attacks are hard to read. So apparently I got lucky by thinking about using the shield. Apparently that's what it's supposed to do. I don't know why. Because, you know, the developers couldn't animate her properly. But should be doable. Most attacks can be dodged. Uh, the only undodgeable attack... Ah! Oh, shut the fuck up. You put an undodgeable attack in your game? Are you fucking kidding me? So it wasn't bad! This game justifies everything I'm saying. This game is bad. They literally have an undodgeable attack because they couldn't figure out the hitboxes on the model. What a load of trash, man. Okay, you know what? I'd like to say whatever game, whatever is whatever, but I'm gonna say this. This game is actually bad. I'm sorry, I'm gonna say this. This game is actually bad. The developers actually thought having a boss with an undodgeable attack that you're forced to use a shield, even though you didn't do it previously. The, the, the developers are actually saying, yeah, there's an undodgeable attack, deal with it. Yeah, guys, what? <laughs> okay. Good thing that I'm not a bad gamer. Or should I say that bad? <laughs> uh, okay, well, what can I say? Um, yeah, G2G, thank you so much, Pharaoh Nick. Um, the only thing you had going for you at this point was...